I learned about alpacas about two years before I was going to retire. So I spent um, up to 34 years and uh, nine months in the military overall, you know, from the beginning to the end. Um, my last job was at the Pentagon and it was uh, strategic planning. So I started this business about 10 years ago, but really it started out as a hobby. Um, I really enjoyed being around the alpacas. Um, I had four of them that I started with. Come on, here we go. Here we go. But then I purchased some more and I also bred and um, more alpacas were born here on the farm. So now I have 37 alpacas. I don't think there's anything more adorable than a baby alpaca. It's called a Kriya. They love to be, you know, they have to be next to their mom because they're still nursing, uh, but they love to frolic and run around and race. They go so fast. They'll run down uh, the pasture and run back and um, they want other Kriyas to um, chase after them and they play. It's just like little kids. It's adorable. For a number of years, it was not profitable um, unless you can really find an outlet for um, your alpaca fleece. Um, but I found that uh, giving the tours uh, has really been uh, nice. I enjoy it. I enjoy sharing my alpacas with other people. I opened a shop. I opened my alpaca shop here on the farm. And then after the tour, I take people in there. Everything in there is made out of alpaca and people really love the items in there. Well, I wanted to um, raise some animals that I didn't need to slaughter in order to make some additional money after I retired. So, you know, I didn't want cows or pigs or something like that. So alpacas, you just shear them once a year and it doesn't hurt them, uh, they actually like it. And it's, it, it is important to do that uh, because of their health too, because they um, cannot get overheated with their fleece. So b before the summer comes, they're sheared. And um, so they run around, they really like it after they're sheared. Alpacas are part of the camelid family. And in that family, you've got camels, llamas, and alpacas. Alpacas are the smallest of that family. And when you think about it, they're each raised for different reasons, too. So alpacas are raised specifically for their fiber. And their uh, fiber is often called fiber of the gods because it's um, as soft as cashmere, it's warmer than wool, and it's also hypoallergenic. In the good weather, they like to be outside. They enjoy the cold weather in the winter time here uh, and they enjoy the snow. They're very curious about it. Uh, they, they are very curious animals and um, they love to watch, you know, everything around them. If I had to choose all over again, you know, going back 10 years ago, I definitely would do the same thing I did. I would definitely get alpacas. I love them so much. Um, they're so cute and they provide so much peace to me. Um, the farm is very peaceful and it's just got a very positive energy with my alpacas here. <laughs>